Sam Altman's journey from teenage coder to global AI visionary reads like a blueprint for a techno-futurist parable. Born in 1985 in Chicago and raised in St. Louis, Altman was gifted his first Macintosh at age eight. That early introduction to computing ignited a lifelong obsession with technology. By his teens, he was already programming, curious not just about what machines could do, but what they might become. Altman enrolled at Stanford to study computer science, but dropped out after two years to co-found Looped, a location-sharing startup. Though Loop didn't become a household name, it gave Altman a foothold in Silicon Valley's entrepreneurial scene. He joined Y Combinator as a participant, then returned later as its president, helping to launch dozens of influential startups, Airbnb, Stripe, and Dropbox among them. But it wasn't until 2015, with the founding of OpenAI, that Altman began shaping the contours of a technological future far larger than any single company. OpenAI, started alongside Elon Musk and other tech luminaries, was born out of a fear and a hope. The fear that artificial general intelligence, AGI, might be created irresponsibly or worse, monopolized. The hope that it could be developed to uplift humanity, not destroy it. Altman, stepping into the CEO role, embraced both sides of that equation. Under his leadership, OpenAI evolved from a non-profit research lab into a global force, with models like GPT-3 and GPT-4 redefining what machines can understand and generate. But for Altman, AI is more than just product development. It's a civilization-defining transition. He sees the future of AI as both extraordinarily bright and perilously unstable. He frequently speaks of AGI not as a distant fantasy, but an imminent reality. If mismanaged, it could lead to social collapse, job displacement, and misuse by bad actors. If guided wisely, it might cure diseases, reinvent education, and unlock new forms of creativity. In interviews, Altman has called for an international regulatory framework, likening AGI to nuclear technology in its need for oversight. Yet he also pushes forward aggressively, believing the best way to understand and manage AI is to build it, with caution, yes, but also with ambition. His paradoxical stance, accelerate while regulating, reflects a deep awareness of the stakes. For Altman, AI isn't simply software. It's an evolutionary force. And as the line between intelligence and code blurs, he's determined to make sure humanity remains not just intact, but empowered.